What is going on ladies and gentlemen, my name is Gunner, and today I bring you guys my guide and just like my preview or review over the uh, Rarity for Mars, it's a really good gun, it comes in epic and legendary uh, rarity and it's a really really good gun, it's definitely a contender to the Scar, the Scar does have its upsides that the um, for Mars does not have uh, like I would say the Scar is a little bit better on range but the for Mars, if you definitely hit somebody on range it's like really really good because it does a lot of damage um, so the epic version of it does 32 damage uh, to the body base, that's the base damage. It will drop off and um, with different ranges you go I think, I'm not really sure but I have not seen too much like damage drop off with it. Uh, so it seems like it has a good amount of damage on range. Uh, the legendary version has 33 damage on the body, I think this has less drop off than the uh, epic one which is kind of nice it makes uh, it makes it so you don't only get the better version of it just to like get more damage it also has a, a range uh, this thing does 62 damage to the head or 64 I'm sorry it did do 62 to 64 it really really depends on the range uh, I found this with the epic one version especially is that it uh, variates from uh, 62 to 64 when you actually shoot people with it uh, with a headshot if it's close up or if it's from a farther distance. The legendary version of it does 66 to the head. Uh, I have only seen 66 headshots with it um, or damage wise. Um, so you can potentially free shot somebody if you hit a headshot with it uh, in a decent amount of range. So if you're in like a close range or like they're in a building next to you and you shoot them, uh, this thing is absolutely really powerful. If you tear through people, it's really, really good to just shoot people with it. Uh, I would definitely recommend just crouching when you shoot with it and not strafe too much. Uh, it is the same with the burst, the burst rifle or the burst AK that you want to call it is really inaccurate when you move. Uh, this thing is a little bit more accurate when you move but it still has some really bad recoil when you shoot with it. So it's definitely it's definitely key to try and stay crouched, stay careful when, or not careful but stay still when you shoot with it. That would definitely help you out. Um, this thing when it drops I have seen it, I found it on the ground a lot of the times landed in a house, I got into the house and it's just there with the, on the ground. Uh, I have not found a legendary version of it that often, I found one in a supply drop. I have not found it on a, uh, on the ground or on a chest. Uh, but I find the purple version or the epic version of it a lot in chest and on the ground. So it's not really hard to find a gun. Uh, I think it has a higher drop rate than the SCAR. Uh, so it's not really hard as I said, it's like, it's between the SCAR and the blue M16. Uh, it's like in the middle of there, so it's good to see that they actually bring up some vari variety and some more guns to have. As me personally, I was hoping for this gun to uh, be, you know, like the M16, it would go from blue to grey. Uh, so we have a little bit more common M uh, common AR to find, because I'm sick of using the M16 a lot and I'm also sick, uh, sick of using the AK. Uh, so it would be nice to find something that's like on the same drop level and then on the same damage level and it's different uh, especially this thing it's really really powerful and it's really fun using it is definitely my go-to rifle in the game right now i haven't played too much with it because i was out traveling but so far i really really enjoy using this thing it is amazing uh it does a lot of damage and uh, it, it in the close quarters is really good to use because it doesn't have that much bullet spread you know when you shoot with the burst ak sometimes one of the bullets will miss and that could potentially get you killed this one does not do that uh, the aim assist on this, for some reason I feel this gun has a lot of aim assist, you can see in the clip earlier uh, that I tried to kill two people at the same time uh, and the aim assist just tried to go over on the guy that I already killed so it's really hard aiming with it. I have no issues with that when I use the SCAR or the M16 or the other burst rifle but this thing seems to have a little bit more aim assist. I don't know if that's only me but it just might be. Um, if you guys have noticed something similar that please let me know because I'm really trying to make detailed guides and guides that actually could help out a lot of people. Uh, so this gun is really really good, I'll definitely make a setup video with it on how you should use it on a, on a get better gameplay split and which weapons you should use to it, like a shotgun or like an SMG uh, and so on. I'm trying to find the legendary version a lot often or I'm trying to find it so I can actually get a lot of footage with that one as well. As you see the footage I have right now is only with the epic version because um, I was unfortunately not recording when I found the legendary version of it uh, which kind of sucks because you can see the difference from it, it's not that much difference but from the range it is a little bit of difference. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed this, and if you did, please leave a like and subscribe and uh, comment in the comment section below. What do you think about this gun? Do you like it? Do you don't like it? Would you see another gun in the game? Me personally, I would just like to see an ordinary AK instead of a FAMAS, but I kind of like the FAMAS. It's a good change to the game, and it adds a little bit more variety when it comes to assault rifles. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed, and uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye. Take care.